uh, take a place and we explore it. We explore the people and the other micro places within it. You'll figure it out. Um, okay, great. So I'm going to start by getting a suggestion for us all. Uh, yeah, just shout out the places in a city. Public bathroom. Not your wrap up. Public bathroom. Boom, boom. No, like more broad. <laughs> for example, we had uh, amusement park, for example. You know, like like broad places or park. You know? Food festival. Keep them coming. Yeah. Wait, it's a Circus. Yeah. City hall.
Wow. Right. Hey, you, uh, you fellas going on this bus? <laughs> no, yeah. I just got off. I'm, I'm, I'm out of here. I'm going on this little bit. I'm going to unlock my bike. But this is where it comes. <laughs> Thank you. That's very No, kind. I'm asking. <laughs> oh, you're asking me. This is where it comes. Yeah. He uh, seems nice. Befriend him. Uh -huh. <laughs> We're now on the inside of a bus that is broken down. Um, this is the inside of the bus. Over here, we have the driver's seat, and then we also see the first row of passenger seats. There's, a, there's a graffiti all inside of the wall here um, with uh, one poem um, by mm, mm, by uh, Emily Dickinson, um, <laughs> as as well as um, just a huge part of the initials VC. Uh, on the on the aisles, there are these little lights, and they 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 blink as you walk down. So they would be like shining by my feet as I walk up and down the. The, the seats on the bus uh, are all steel, um, and this one has a little, uh, little padding on it. So to recap, we're inside of a bus that is broken down. We see the driver's seat and the first row of seats on the bus. <laughs> There's graffiti over here, a poem by Emily Dickinson, a big heart that says VC. Down the aisle, there are little lights that shine as you walk by. And then these are steel seats with one padded one. It's fucked! <laughs> yeah, it's fucked. Um, That's why, because uh, here's why. Okay, I thought it through. That, that bus, before it was the maintenance bus, was a broken down bus. <laughs> so it was already like end of the line. Yes. So you're just saying that we should just keep the cycle of violence going. It's, it's, like, <laughs> it's like, it's like, if you had like just a, just like a line of dominoes. You know, and, and like each domino represents each. Hey, focus, man. I, I, it's a good metaphor. Okay. Like each domino represents a bus. So as as the domino falls, it's like the life's the life's brand new bus graveyard. Right. Well, yeah, what that, happens when you get to the end of the domino like, line? <laughs> Scarcity of resources. Yeah. It's economics. All right. Um, this next The, the bus station. Um, so right here, there's a, a, a window with a, a little thing here that you can speak into and ask for information. 
Uh, yeah, and then um, behind the window uh, is this is where the person behind the window sits and you know feeds stuff under. Um, over here, there's uh, there's um, two chairs here that you can sit on while you're waiting because usually the person in the information booth is pretty slow, and so you have to wait a long time. There's three chairs. Um, on this wall is an impressionist painting of a bus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. To recap. Um, over here, there's an informational window. Um, I guess it will be facing this way. Uh, and there's a little hole here that you can speak through and get information. Behind the information window is the person who feeds stuff under. Three waiting chairs. And on this wall is an impressionist painting of a bus.
Potato <laughs> choice. <laughs> cheese oh, crisps. Cheese crisps. Carrots. Carrots. Oh. You know, a lot of orange snacks. <laughs> I think I'll go with the, yeah. the crisps. No, no, no. Come on now. What? You said I get to choose. I know, but I thought you made the right choice now. <laughs> the right choice? Of course it's the right, the right choice. It's probably the right choice. Right. Well, uh, what? Uh, <laughs> I love to. Uh, I had to go uh, with a... Uh, with a what? I guess it's the carrots. <laughs> yeah, you're just doing that because you choose the other one. <laughs> Larry, what do you think? I mean, this whole, this whole like situation, we we depend on like public transport. You're you're like a slave to the. The system, you know. We're pawns. We're, we're, we're just, we're, we're, we're moving around in these, like, tubes of metal. I don't like it. It's like we're meat. I was thinking about that, too. You know. Ah. Don't sell those benches, man. You know what's been here? There are more microbes on those benches. <laughs> Then there are cells in a human reticle. <laughs> you know what? It's like, not only are we pawns, we're being covered in scum from day one to the day we die. Well, I have a no face touching <laughs> policy though, so I'm good. No microbes get anywhere close to me. Francis, how does that help at all if you don't touch somebody else's face? That's not the problem. No, I don't touch my own face. Your face is touching the air 100% of the time, or else you would be dead. And I mean, don't get me there. Don't get me started. Don't get me started on pollution. Pollution. Don't do that. That is dangerous. Do you want a baby wipe? <laughs> no, but other parts are touching their face. <laughs> Do you consider anything about the world at all, or are you just an ignorant person? <laughs> I didn't realize people were so unfriendly in this town. True. Don't you get it? We're trying to help you. We love this town. Yes. <laughs> I would trade it for the world. All right. All right. I love this. Oh, don't look. <laughs> Let me tell you. This is not a man I'm making in this town. We can go. Have you Have you ever heard of of the Third Street Home? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> that's us. <laughs> it seems like you guys got a lot figured out. I'm gonna go. I don't like being insulted. You want to no, no, no. You want to drive mango? <laughs> Here, clean your hands first. Clean your hands. Stop touching your face. <laughs> His mom grows mangoes and then dries them in her own backyard. Oh yeah. Tell me another town where there's. That kind of horticultural, horticulture. I love this town so much. Why well, got a tattoo of New York City? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you must ask. You can ask that. <laughs> Father of three, he, he had to work all 
day, and he, he got home, and his children were asleep, but he made sure that every morning, he was the one who, who woke them up, and then, and then he tucked them back in, because he had to leave very early for work, <laughs> and it wasn't time for they needed more sleep. <laughs> That's where that's where he was right there. Now we got a we got a speedy truck on 995. I'm sitting on 95. Okay, it looks like there's somebody just went through a stoplight over on first and second. And then we slide on over there right now.
done drawing a picture of your face. <laughs> like it even has all three of your moles. <laughs> this is a little bigger though. Oh, you're right. Has it got even bigger? A little. <laughs> Usually when we make out, the lights are off. So. <laughs> Wait. Well, you can feel them. Yeah, but I'm usually not kissing your right cheek. <laughs> oh, it's got another bump on it, like a mole on your mole. <laughs> Maybe we should make this graffiti 3D. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> <laughs> nice, the game's flat. Oh, Challenge me. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't hear you. This is that connection. His, his voice just got his voice just got lower. I think he 
might be, you know. Is he hitting puberty in front of your eyes? <laughs> <laughs> it might be that. I don't know. He's, he's going through some kind of transformation. Is he a, a werewolf? <laughs> <laughs> Are you on the road? Are you on the road? Yeah, I'm driving right now. Hmm? Is he coming? He's coming, huh? You want to take a seat? All right. I don't. <laughs> oh my God.
and on the side of the, of the dock, yeah. you see, come on, do I have to spell it out? On the side of the dock, there's, there's a yeah. bus. Oh, yeah. There's a bus on the side of the dock. Wait, so the bus is like the yellow one, and then the, the crime is all the red? There, just don't forget about the crime. Okay. The crime is in the bus. The crime's in the bus. We got kids. We got, we got kids. Kids. It's it's out a there. metaphor for what's going on the screen. Uh, okay. Lately, we've had a graffiti artist write Emily Dickinson poems on the sides of the bus. <laughs> like, there could be worse things if you read it. That's kind That's of. That's not worse things. Okay. Dickinson. <laughs> <laughs> There's like Dickinson. Don't love drugs. 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 Emily, drugs Dickinson. Emily Dickinson loves drugs. <laughs> <laughs> That's, she that's all she writes about. Miss Nolan, in class last week, that was like, I've read it. Okay. I've read it. I've read every poem. I've read every poem. They're all about drugs. Yep. Every poem. The other poems that other poets write, not about drugs. Emily Dickinson? Drugs. Drugs. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Art is drugs. Art is drugs. That's true. That's true. People don't make good art. This is maintenance crew 54. Um, I've rapped upon the window of bus X. <laughs> maintenance crew 54 over and still online. I can't be reached with a double negative account. <laughs> Maintenance crew 54 engaging protocol for entry of bus. <laughs> hey, he's trying to come in the bus. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> you like that your face is in my ass? <laughs> <laughs> I like you. <laughs> Big. Like I like your ass. Big. I like you too. I like the position of my face. <laughs> Safety assurance <laughs> protocol A, meet response affirmative before entry. I think that other people will learn about love. We're coming in as affirmative dogs. <laughs> over, over. Waiting for a response from inside a bus that is affirmative okay for my entry. Entry is affirmative, babe. <laughs> Oh, 
Oreos. Yeah, okay, that's the one time the bus is breaking down. <laughs> oh, wait, sir, it's not happening every time. Well, consider that I've taken the bus once, and that one time, no bus can use it. There's so many bus that's so small. I've been taking the bus so many times. Okay, well, 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 fine. Sure, all right. Well, how can I really trust that, you know, last time, didn't, didn't come? Oh, you're so... Is there someone next to you? I think I see it on the peripheral FaceTime. Yeah, why, why do you ask that person um, about their best experiences? I bet they're really positive. Why don't you ask them if you're so interested? Okay, well, you, you can like shift me around if you want. <laughs> Hi, Yippee, if you're on the phone. Hi. Hey. <laughs> Just one St. Louis resident to another. Well, why don't you help out my friend here? So she's been with us once. That time it broke down. She's a little nervous. She's talking to you. Yeah, you can hide. Yeah, we're kind of this This feels like eye contact. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> sorry, what was that? I'm just trying to get a, get a hold of the situation. <laughs> sorry. My friend is on FaceTime with you, talking to you. Yeah, and you hi. are talking to my friend. <laughs> Um, have you ever ridden the bus and had a knock? Yeah, I ride it every day. Yeah, it's good, right? It's good. <laughs> right? Yeah, it's good. It's yeah. good. It's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Sorry. See, makes you fine. You are worried about riding the bus? I'm a little worried. She's so worried. Like in St. Louis. You gotta get used to it, you know? You can't you're... ride your bike. Well, what about the bike racks right over there? Huh? Oh, well, some people do. <laughs> <laughs> well, all I'm saying is 100% of the times that I've tried to ride a bus in this city, the bus has not come. She no shit! Once, one time, one other time. Only one time! <laughs> you know what? The bus is a fickle thing, you know what I mean? <laughs> so is life. You can't trust life. Just like you can't trust the bus. Just like you can't trust the police. Oh. <laughs> just like you can't trust parents, you know what I mean? It's all just pickle. Parents? Police? Tell me you got more about that. <laughs> what are you? What your, what your uh, visions are? My visions? 
Louis. Yeah. About St. Louis? Like what you're feeling right now, because I got a little secret for you. So I just been a newbie. Oh. Sorry, man. 
No, you're, you're good, you're good. Um, I just gotta get this thing out of here. It's better, it's uh... I know, I've been here! Yeah, I know you've been here. You, you chill out, dude. Okay. Uh, <clears throat> Jeez, you look so much like my coworker. Um, hey, you know, I'm gonna be tall. Are you back there? I think I sent him for some waters. Uh, yeah. Oh shit, Tom. There you are. You know, we were just looking for you. Search complete. <laughs> great, great. Um, now, can I, can I get you guys, you folks, out of there? We gotta hook this this thing up. We gotta get it out of here. We gotta get this out of here. Thanks so much for all your work. You didn't find any uh anything else? Did no, you? no, found nothing. And uh, in fact, I have another call I have to take. Oh, sh okay. Yeah. So. True. See you later, Tom. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. Um, okay. Now, this hook, excuse me. Oh. I just gotta get this uh, hook on the front of this vehicle. <clears throat> just tighten that puppy down. Um, just gotta get the other side of this hook. Just gonna watch me do my work. <laughs> do you need help? Yeah, I do. <laughs> okay. Get this hook. Uh, it's got a little rust on it. You need to clean that off first. Do you have? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you don't usually work with your hands. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I drive. That's mostly. <laughs> <laughs>
So Albany, huh? You can sit in the front. Oh, there's, there's other passengers as well, but you're welcome to sit in the front of the bus. Nobody ever takes this seat. We call it the cold seat of the bus. No one takes it. No one takes this. There's a mnemonic device that I need to <laughs> I wish I had that one. I think that's it. Does that mean anything to you? Because that is how I'm going to get to where I need to go. Oh, all right. Well, look, we can figure it out together. Exceptional. What's exceptional in this world? Stardust? <laughs> uh, <laughs> metronomes? Hey, bus! Hey, we're going to make a stop now, everybody. Um, just going to put this in slow. <laughs> we're going to move into the ladder, laterally to the right. Passengers are moving loudly to the right to pick up this person. Ready for the right. Shh, shh, doors. You got a lean? Is that what you're telling us? What did you say? You got a lean? Is that what you're telling us? Make sure there's clear communication in all the driving aspects okay. of this bus. <laughs> now I'm going to open the doors. Stellar. They look very careful. Shh. They look actually careful, babe, but there's only one seat left. The bus will look to the side. Uh, that's for, um, you know, yeah. handicap accessibility. We also have this ramp that will come down if necessary. It doesn't seem necessary in this case, so I'm not going to engage it. Right. Let's just go. We need it. We need it. Yeah. Excuse us. Ah, welcome aboard the bus. Hello. This is a loquacious driver. <laughs> Here, you take the seat. Wait, babe, we can share the seat. <laughs> You're right. Good thing that you don't have the seat up there. It's like under some stuff. Excuse me? Oh. Non-compliant passengers upon the bus. Non-compliant. 
Yeah, they're, uh, um, well, they're, uh, they're... Oh, look, it's our stop. Wow. Oh, hey. Uh, nice. There's another abandoned bus next to this one. You want to shot in there, baby? Okay. Yeah. Alright. Okay. I'm going to pull over and let these people off. This is actually technically not an official stop, so I'm actually not supposed to do this. I will for the sake of this, because you've been so compliant. Supposed to go inside of that bus, but not an officer with you. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to write this up when I get back. <laughs>